It looks like the next iPhone could be running into some roadblocks thanks to a new Touch ID. Previous rumors suggested the home button would completely disappear on Apple's 10th anniversary model to make room for a larger edge-to-edge -edge display. The fingerprint scanner would be embedded into the display panel, making the entire screen an unlock surface. But unless they figure out something fast, they may end up having to scrap this feature altogether. According to Pacific Crest Securities analysts, Apple's component suppliers are struggling to make this technology happen on time. In this case, Apple would still announce its 5.8-inch iPhone during its slated September launch event, along with a 7S and 7S Plus model. But it wouldn't get into the hands of consumers until as late as November. Or Apple could take a page out of the Samsung playbook and just slap the sensor on the back of the phone, as reported by SlashLeaks. Samsung was said to be considering a similar feature in the S8, but ended up having to move the sensor to the back of the phone next to the camera lens. Or if all else fails, Apple could rely solely on facial recognition to unlock the phone, a potentially less secure form of authentication unless they're able to deliver on that 3D depth sensing camera.